The National Enquirer, its parent company AMI, and its boss David Pecker just keep finding their way in and out of legal trouble in relation to Donald Trump's scandals. Now the Enquirer gang has decided to sell Trump out in the hope of keeping itself out of even more legal trouble. We already saw Pecker and the National Enquirer sell Donald Trump and Michael Cohen out to the SDNY in return for immunity. But then Pecker blew his immunity when he got caught trying to blackmail Trump's longtime nemesis Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos, and now Pecker is in real danger of facing serious criminal charges. So he's selling Trump out yet again. Pecker and Ami have agreed to turn over Trump related documents to the House Judiciary Committee, according to CBS News. Based on the nature of the document request, these are ostensibly the same documents that they've already turned over to the SDNY. So this won't necessarily further incriminate Trump, but it will serve to publicly incriminate Trump as the committee will turn around and use these documents as part of its public hearings on Trump's crimes. The National Enquirer gang keeps playing games, of course, so it's possible they could be disingenuous in their announcement that they're going to cooperate. But in this instance, they have nothing further to lose by turning over documents to the House Democrats that they've already turned over to prosecutors. So we're about to see more of Trump's dirt. In any case, this cooperation won't keep Pecker out of prison if that's where he's headed.